Factory worker turned soldier DJ is describing the toll that nightmares and broken sleep are taking on his mental health. His experience is part of a growing challenge for Ukraine's exhausted army as it seeks to hold at bay its much larger Russian enemy. Now, in a makeshift classroom in the east of the country, psychotherapist Ol Hukovsky is running sessions for combat veterans like DJ on how to cope with the stress of war, especially during extended periods at the front. 45 days, it's a critical period when soldier can stay and, uh, let's say, have a chance to stay mental healthy. So after 45, almost everyone will be broken in a way. And we have situation when they can be very long time, much longer. And they are getting a lot of concussions, um, a lot of combat fatigue is very prevalent, I would say. Many of those fighting joined as volunteers with limited preparation. Reuters spoke to four soldiers undergoing treatment. They spoke of exhaustion, stress, anxiety, fear, and guilt, but also of camaraderie and a sense of obligation to hurry back to fight. Finn says he eventually recognized that he needed help. I was told that I needed some rest, some medical treatment. I said that I was good and that they were making up things. I did not feel that way. But after the last mission, I started feeling that I could not bear it anymore. The shelling was especially difficult. I knew that I was on the brink of having a breakdown. While many soldiers who seek psychological support return to battle after short breaks, other, more serious cases are sent to rehabilitation points away from the front. Psychotherapist Ol Hukovsky again. Some people, they can need longer treatment, for example. So it's, usually it's a long process. It's not like, okay, today you feel not okay, go home. Usually it's a long process because we need all people we can, we can keep in our army. Ukraine's armed forces declined to answer questions on how many soldiers had been treated for psychological conditions since the start of the invasion. Such details are often treated as military secrets.